Yo, what, what is, is up guys, welcome back to another YouTube video, so guys, guys I'm going to write into Brandon, aka okay, for a new YouTube video, YouTube video he made today, today can I can speak, speak. And, and he went to his new house, his house, house was haunted, haunted with, with his cousin, cousin Noor, so, so let's, let's get, get right into it, also, also I, have I have a cookie, cookie by me, guys, you can like, see right there, there. It's, it's pretty, pretty good. good. I like these. And, and I'm watching, watching my, my favorite streamer, the Peach, Peach Cobbler. Cobbler. Like, like my favorite, favorite female, female streamer. It's kind of right. bright. But, but yeah. yeah. Let's, Let's get, get right into it. it. What is going on, you guys? Brandon here, aka Bawadis. Today I'm with. Noor. And a lot of you guys watching this video know the history that me and my family have with ghosts. Yeah, that house looks creepy. Haunted experiences in our life. And in case some of you guys don't know, I recently purchased my own home. I bought a brand new home, and I haven't moved in yet. I'm really, really close to moving into this house. I'm about to get some furniture and finally move in. But I decided, just because of the experiences that me and my family have had with ghosts, I sort of want to explore my new house. Both before moving in, just to kind of see if this house is haunted. Before I enter this house, I just want everybody watching this video to know, I've never been here at night. I haven't spent a night in this house. This is my first time entering my brand new home. No, don't be scared. Come on in. This is my first time entering my brand new house at night. So I'm bringing you guys with me. And Dennis, if you'd like to move out the way, we are officially closing the door. So guys, in case you can't tell, look around. Look at the house. There's gonna be an echo because this house is still empty. There's no furniture in here yet. It's a big empty house. Um, yeah. In typical Awadis family fashion, before we even order furniture to my house, we're exploring to see if there is any ghosts in this house. Yeah. So, what better thing to do on a late October night than to conjure spirits, right? Come on, yep. is it not normal? The first thing you do when you buy a house, you don't order furniture, a bed, a couch, or anything. You go ghost hunting. Okay, guys, um, in case you're not familiar with some of the equipment I have in my hand, these have been featured in Phase Rug's video, so I actually got these from him. He let me borrow this ghost equipment for today's video, so you guys might be familiar with this, but this right here, this is an EMF meter. Right now, it's at green. When this thing detects any different type of energy, aka spirits or anything like that, this thing will shoot up. It'll shoot up. There's yellow, there's orange, there's red. So right now, if you take a look, Right now in the area we're standing, it's still on green, so it doesn't look like there's any type of spirit or any type of energy over here. These things, these are cat balls. So as you could tell, they're all lit up right now. Crazy thing about these when it comes to ghosts, look at this. So I'm gonna put these on the floor, right? Okay, we're gonna wait for it to stop flashing. There, boom. They're done flashing. Oh my gosh, flashing. Oh my God, that means something just flashed. Already? Already. I didn't okay, touch you guys, them. the thing with these is that once they go off, it means that something touched them. And they say, like, ghost hunters, like, all these people say that, like, once the cat ball goes off, like... Like, like that? that? Guys, hold Dude, hold on. Let me, Let me explain it real quick because I'm actually scared. Once the cat ball goes off, that's, like, when most people just leave the house. Like, and that's how baby. serious... Wait, no, this is actually scary. No, this is, like, worst case scenario. Okay, guys, so the reason we're freaking out right now is look at this. When you do any sort of motion around these balls, look, they don't light up. These things are not detected by motion. Look at this. I'm going all around it. These cat balls are not detected by motion. You have to physically for them to go off. So how was this one in the middle going off right when we started this video? You guys just saw this middle one going off. How? There has to be something here. Dude, that's not a good thing. Like usually they go off like when it's like like seriously like bad shit is happening. It's like a warning. That's very true. In any ghost video I've ever done, the cat balls have not went off till the end when things are getting very intense, very serious. The fact that this one went off, dude, we haven't even started the ghost hunting. I was just trying to explain what the cat balls are. The fact that it already went off, I think we're being warned right now not to do this video. Okay, no, I have an idea. So since the cat ball already went off over here, how about we leave one? One of them in this area of the house and we'll check on it in a couple minutes to see if it's going on. Okay guys. That's the first area where you can test it so 
energy. Spirit or energy. Okay, since we already had a little encounter in this area of the house, we're going to go ahead. Look at this candle. It is not flashing right now. Remember, it does not flash just from you walking next to it. It needs to physically be touched for it to go off. So we're going to leave this here. We're going to walk so crazy, bro. And we'll come back and check on this in a couple of minutes. So, yeah. Just leave this here and uh, keep exploring. No, you know what my fear is? I hope that I'm not bringing the spirit into this house by doing it. Like, I hope that this house wasn't clean and ready to be moved into, and then me making this video is pretty much a way of me. Yeah, I hope I'm not inviting a spirit in because that's not my intention. My intention is I kind of just want to find out if there's already a spirit here. The EMF meter. Seems to be going good. It's not going off right now. Um, this is my living room area. This is my kitchen area. It seems like we've made it through this area pretty clean. Wait. Okay, wait. It literally just went to the yellow around here, but every time like, I, sh I try to show you guys, it turns off. Hey, I'm not gonna lie. There have been a lot of times when I filmed the haunted video with Faze Rudd. A lot of haunted stuff happens off camera. Yeah. And then when I'm like, Brian, Brian, record this, nothing happens. I feel like sometimes ghosts, they don't like to they show. They like mess with you. Yeah, they mess with you. They troll you. They, they get you mad. They get you angry. So sometimes they don't do stuff on camera because they don't want people to believe you. But yeah. look, now that we're recording, the meter's on green. But sometimes when the camera's off, this thing shoots up. I know I sound like flight right now. Oh, the camera wasn't on, but this thing shot up. But I'm being serious. Okay, guys, I'm trying to see where to place the next cat ball. But I don't want to place it in an area. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, dude, dude, it's orange. It was orange. See, as soon as you bring the camera, as soon as you bring the camera closer, it's like it goes away. But did you get when it was orange? I swear on my was, life. Please tell me you recorded when it flashed orange. I swear to God, it was orange. I saw. I think I got it on camera, bro. So no, should we put a cap? You guys, you guys, you guys, you guys. Orange again. Look, I it just. No, here, let me hold this. No, do you think it's yeah. in this area, or do you think, guys, follow me? No, in here. no, no, no. Look. Did it follow me in this room? I want to know if the EMF meter was going off from this room right here or if it was from outside. Oh, Guys, in case you can't tell, we're in the wine cellar right now. Do, 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 do. No, Bro. no, 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 no. Bro, I swear, it. whenever the camera gets close to it, you see it just drop. This thing I jumps like so orange. So whenever so Dennis so points the camera back to the meter, it goes back to green. The ghost is literally messing with us right now. Okay, that's scary though. It's not a nice ghost, so maybe we should leave. So far, the ghost hasn't made itself very known that it's here. It has given us a little bit of a sign, but I don't think the ghost has done anything too drastic for us to be like, oh my god, let's get out of the house. I think okay, for now. Not, no, I, I think for now we're still. Chilling. North, what do you guys say next? We go down the hallway. No, I'm avoiding oh, that. Actually, we have to go down here first. This okay, no, that's scary. That room in the bathroom, that bathroom creeps me out. Though. Down here, this hallway, this is where most of my bedrooms are. So if you want to follow me and we can explore the bedroom, um, I know there's actually. <gasps> no! No, no, on my life that turned on. No, get out. Oh, on my no. life that just turned on. Maybe something you hidden? did it. On my life, I didn't do it. You did it. Oh my god. Bro, I didn't do that, man. Oh my god. Dennis, you, you fucking did it. Maybe something triggered it. Look, it's literally on a YouTube video. You guys Dennis, look me in the eyes. Me. You're my boy. Did you do it yesterday? Man, I didn't do it, bro. No. Give me the remote. Dude, I was right next to you. Empty your pockets right now. Empty your pockets. What are you looking for? Dude, no. What do you want? The remote? Yes. It's right there. The remote is literally right there, bro. Oh, bro. The lady says video possible. I swear, look, I have goosebumps right now. I literally I have goosebumps. Too. The remote is right there. Who's messing with me? Bro, man, I don't think any of us are messing with you right now, bro. bro Unless you're messing with us. 
Swear on your life you didn't just mess with us. I swear on my life I didn't do that. Wait, guys, I really don't know. No, that, no, 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 no. Guys, what the f just happened? Dude, I thought you were just go off. No, I don't want to do that. No, say swear you didn't turn that TV on. Brandon, I'm trying to tell us to get out of here, but why would I touch the TV? I don't even know how to turn the, I didn't even know that. Say swear. I swear on everything, bro. What the f just happened? I was just standing here saying how we don't have like a for sure sign that there's a ghost here. We haven't had anything drastic happen. I and then the you don't invite it because like that's too much, bro. How did that TV? Move in here, like you don't need this stuff happening. Okay, maybe the Quincy. How did that TV turn off? Um, Hold on, here's the meter. Dude, we're not even fifty percent done with the house. Hey, this is being, this is like just creepy at this point, bro. Okay, you know what, bro? Can we just go down the hallway? Oh my, my goodness. goodness. I don't want to be in this area right here, by this. Okay, Norris, you ready to go through the bedroom? No, dude, that's even scary. You know what's actually creepy? When I first moved into this house, I walked into that room and I said, yo, this room is creepy. We got to do something about this room. Is it the one where you used to have a curtain in there? You used to have a curtain? I would not enter that room. Like, you guys are about to see it. I don't even want to go in there. Wait, that. is that the one with the weird creepy carpet? It used to have a creepy carpet, but I made sure we changed it. Yeah, I always remember seeing the carpet and had a chandelier in there. The chandelier's still oh, in there. Yeah, 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 okay, yeah, let's yeah, go. Yeah. Guys, look. Dude, you got the chandelier. You can't tell me the chandelier doesn't give off haunted vibes. The carpet, I made sure to change. And we put this new gray carpet in here because I swear to you, when I first moved in, this room had a weird, creepy, spooky carpet. That guys, I guys, 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 guys. <gasps> oh, 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 my God. Oh, my God. I swear to God, it was orange. On my life, on everything I love, I saw it. I, sw I think I got it on camera. I swear to God, it was orange. Guys, I'm telling you. Guys, guys, it's over here. Well, it goes every down every time. time I go on it, on my life. Did you zoom in, Dennis? I think so, but it just goes down every time. Every time you record. <gasps> no, look, did you see okay, that? No, turn it around. Actually, Brandon, look, without the camera, what color is it? Look at it. It's look red. It. It's red. Show Dennis, it. show it. Shut oh, up. Bro. Oh, wow. No one's going to believe it. No one's gonna believe it. Dennis, Dennis. Look. They got it. Boom. No, you okay. got it. Bro, this is so weird. Every single time the meter is on camera, look at this. What color is it? Green. Every time we turn it away off camera, it goes to like orange or red. It's the creepiest thing. And and what's scary is, of course, it's happening in this room. I'm telling you guys, right when I bought this house, I walked into this room, and the first thing I told my dad, I told my dad, this room is creepy. We got to change the carpet. And we also got to take out the chandelier. That's the next step we're doing. We haven't gone around to doing it yet. And what do you know? There's a fucking attic in this room. And suddenly everything makes a lot more sense. Now everything makes a lot more sense. Do we have a ladder here? Maybe somewhere in the house. So like the garage or something. I'll go up in the attic because I want answers. I'm not no, about to. No, no, I'll go. No. You don't have to come. No. Nor. Think about Dude, it. Dude, if it touched the cat ball, it turned the TV on, and it's literally like the EMF meter is going off here, why would you? No, bro, no. All I'm saying is I'm about oh to move into this house. I invested a lot of money into this house. I plan on living here for a very long time. I don't want to move in here confused. I don't want to move in here with questions. I want to figure everything out today. And if that means going up into the attic by myself, then I'll do it. Because I swear to you guys, there's something in this room. It Dude, started... The crazy thing is, the paranormal activity in this room, it did not start today. I'm telling you, from the second I bought this house, I knew there was something here because I felt something in this room. And now this proves it. Okay, let's keep exploring the house. If I find the ladder, you know what? Forget the ladder, bro. You think I could climb this? I want answers. I feel like there's something in this attic. I feel like I'm very cool. You think so? No, it's good. We're gonna take a twist? Yeah, stable. Come on. I don't know, can you feel it, Dennis? Is it good? I think it'll be good for our client. Well, I'll just be careful. That's weird. It's scary, bro. You're crazy? Are you really going to do that? Yeah. I just don't want to move in here without answers. I don't want to move in here like wondering, like, oh, is there something in this house? Is there something in this room? I want all the answers before I move in. Just because based on the experiences me and my brother have had in our life, I don't, I, I just, I'm, I'm over it. I'm over it. So...
Okay, guys, I'm about to open this. Guys, Brandon, don't go up there. Brandon, Brandon don't go up there. Brandon. On my life, it was orange. There, on my life, it was orange, and I got it on camera this time for Brandon, sure. Don't go up there, bro. Wait, it turned orange just from me opening. On my Why life, it turned orange, oh and I got it on the camera. Brandon, don't, don't go up there. Bro, bro, I'm, I'm, what, bro I'm sick of ghosts messing with me and my brother. I'm going up there, bro. Dennis, please get a close up on this. Dan, let me see the camera now. No. Be careful, man. Alright, guys. I can't see too much because I don't have a ladder. But here's what it looks like up there. What color is it? Is it? Okay, guys. So without a ladder, it's... Yeah. Without a ladder, it's hard for me to actually get up there. Oh my. Oh, bro. Bro, hold guys. On, hold on, should I zoom it's in? Red. Dennis, it's in. red. Hold on, it's blurry. Guys, please look what happens to this meter every time I put it into the attic. Look at this. You guys see? Look at it. Look, look, look at that. Bro, it's literally bro. out. You guys see that? Yeah, bro. Look, look. Look. Bro, someone hold this. I gotta close this attic, bro. Holy shit, dude. I have the biggest headache. This is, like, not a good thing. I knew from the second I bought this house that this room was just different. I really have to go, bro. Yo, I'm sweating. I have a headache. You want water? Let's go get you water, Norm. I don't want to go out there. This is, see, I'm too afraid of this room, but I'm also scared of what I'm going to see over there. Because the TV and the cowboys. That attic was clean. Okay, guys, come here. Okay, guys, um, I have a little plan. So there's still a lot more rooms that we need to explore in this house, but I feel like at that point, we're just wasting our time because clearly there's something in this house. Either there's something in this house or there's something attached to me. I'm not sure, I'm confused. If you guys have any idea, let me know in the comment section down below. Do you think there's something in this house already from the previous owners? Or do you think that whatever spirit or whatever you know entity is just following me and it's attached to me? I don't know, but it seems, Shut up. Dennis. Dude, 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 no, yeah. use your flash. The light went off. <gasps> you think dude, 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 dude. It's orange. It's dude, orange. Once the light turned off, I swear my life started flashing. Oh, oh my gosh. gosh. No. All my life, once the light turned off, that thing started flashing. You know, what, you know what's fucking crazy? Bro. When I filmed the haunted video with Brian, Noah's battery light died. Mess? Wait, we just bought that brand new today. Yeah. We haven't even been filming for an hour. Should I try turning it back on? No, yeah. I don't want to be here. Wait, Dennis, did you do that on purpose? Oh, oh. No, Dennis, swear to God. On my life, on everything I love, my finger wasn't even near that, that the button. Can I see this one? Okay. Dude, no, no. I have goosebumps right now. Oh, I thought that was my piece. They swear that wasn't me. I swear to God, on my life, it wasn't me. This is the camera we're recording it, right? The battery couldn't have died because, look, it's on right now. The light is on right now. So the battery oh, could not have died. How did it shut off and then the meter started going off? Dude, I'm just saying, on my life, no, I believe you. Dude. Sorry, Sorry for, for the, the background noise, guys. Dude, Dennis, you have blues going. Oh, and it's like the fourth, fifth time. Dude, no, no, no. Whoa. I thought the battery of that guy, I was like, dude, how? We just bought it and we haven't even been filming for what, 45 minutes? There's no way the battery life is that bad. But then now it's back on and it's working. So it couldn't have been the battery. Yeah, and then the meter went off right after. Look, the meter's not going off now. It's still on green. But the second that light shut off, that meter started flashing. Yo, what the hell, bro? Okay, like I was saying, there are a lot more rooms we could explore. But I think that the spirit has already made it known that, you know, it's here. There's something here. Like, we don't have to explore any more rooms for us to know that there's something here the spirit the entity whatever is in this house has made it known that it's here so i think the next thing we should do this probably isn't the smartest decision but it'll help us get answers um i think we should try to talk to the spirit bro i'm kind of good off that bro bro listen i'm kind of good off that bro 
that's inviting them. If you try to talk to them, they're already invited. That they're really no, is no, like opening the door. They're already here. No, the there's spirit. a veil. There's a spirit world, a veil, and our world. You're gonna try talking to them, bro, dude. They're bro. bro. Okay, I think we should try to talk to the spirit. I came here today to get answers, not to get half the answers and then go home. I came here today to get full answers before I'm moving to this house because I don't want to move into this house unless I explore it completely and get all the answers that I'm looking for. I'm not doing this because I'm bored and I do this for fun. I actually don't find this fun at all. I'm actually pretty scared. I've just had enough. All these paranormal experiences I've dealt with in my life, I don't want it to keep happening. I finally bought my own house. I bought a new house. I don't want to move in here scared. I don't want to move in here, you know, questioning, oh, is this house haunted? I want to get all the answers I'm looking for tonight. So, um, and I'm not gonna lie, it is very crazy, you know, that I'm gonna try to talk to the spirit right now, but if you guys were in my position, just dealing with so many ghost things, haunted stuff throughout my whole life, you guys would do the same thing. You, you would just want answers. Okay guys, so over here, the app that we're using, this is called the Spirit Talker. When me and Faze Rugg did a haunted video a couple weeks ago, we used the same app. We actually had a medium with us. You know, a medium is someone who could- Like talk to spirit. Yeah, she could contact oh my goodness. spirit. And she told us that this app App was the best one, the most accurate one to use if you're trying to talk to a spirit. So here we have the spirit talker. I'm not gonna ask that. a few questions. Paranormal research device. We're gonna start it. We're gonna put the EMF on. So I'm gonna go ahead and start. First, I'll introduce myself to any spirit that's over here right now. My name is Brandon. I'm moving into this home, and I just want to know if there's somebody in here somebody or something in here if there is something in here please let it be known wait you said something it's unfinished something. business dude that literally means it's following you bro. bro is this saying it's unfinished business with you yeah. dude wait, wait wait look at my eyes my eyes just got watery look at this can you see oh my god bro dude, your I, eyes are so red dude i just got the chills wait can you guys ask me something else okay is this unfinished business with me brandon or is it with this house she screams. We heard. Remember? Remember in your video, bro? The sour one? The sour one where we heard a scream, bro. Oh my god. A couple weeks ago, me and Nor were here. We were filming a sour video. And we heard a girl scream in the middle of the video. I hope I still have the footage somewhere dug up on my computer. Nor, what do we have for level three? We have some sour slime. Look at this. Yum. Nor, have you ever tried this? No. This just looks potent. Potent. <laughs> Shut up. Shut up. Are you kidding me? Well, that's not I haven't even moved into this house yet and it's already haunted. No, for sure. I really heard a... Yo! Like a cat or something. Wait, Yo! Can you check the front driveway? Come on, man. No, I swear there was another one. Wait, you guys heard something, right? Okay. It just sounded like it was a scream, yeah, like a girl. A scream? I thought I heard the front door open right here. I mean, my car is here, obviously, but there's no other car in the driveway. Wait, did that door open? Was that door always open? You heard that. I heard it. We all it was like... No, I can't believe she said. Screams. She screams after what we heard during the video. Um, does the spirit want me to move into this house, or is that a bad idea? Dude, I'm gonna throw up. Oh my god. Wait, so is it a girl? Or a girl? Please make... Roman? Wait, you said is it a boy or a girl? It said Roman. You just said is it a boy or a girl and it said Roman. Dude, I'm getting the chills. No, right dude, I'm getting, I don't know if it shows. You see the goosebumps. Roman. Don't acknowledge the name. Bro. You want answers, Nora. Roman, are you a good spirit or do you mean harm? <laughs> It's in the front, it's in the front. Nor, Dennis, did you record what it said? Oh, boy, Show what it said. Wait, can you turn that off? He said, are you, he said, are you a good spirit or a bad spirit? Dark entity here. I literally asked Roman, are you a good spirit or a bad spirit? And it said, dark entity here. My Wait, can you turn off that app? I really thought I'm a girl, bro. No. Can I throw up and use my girl here? Yeah, yeah. You could, you could. Do you want water in here? No, Granny, can I put this down real quick? Yeah. Bro, my stomach's really hurting. Hold on, bro. Why did I want to talk to the spirit? Is it just in your house or is it in your house? Oh my god.
It's a Roman. Yeah. And then you said, are you a good spirit? I don't know. I'm done with this, bro. Yo. We shouldn't have even done this, bro, for real. Guys, I really... No, delete the app. Delete the app, bro. Nah, delete the app, I'm telling you. Yo, guys. Put this away, too. I put that away, too, bro. Dude, All guys, it. listen, listen. Like, a part of me regrets coming into my new house and talking to spirits, but another part of me, like, it had to be done. It had to be done. I've experienced so much ghost stuff in my life that, it, like, I wouldn't be comfortable buying a new house and moving in without experiencing oh. answers because I'm just confused. Me and my brother both. Me and my brother off camera always talk about the ghost experiences we have, how this paranormal stuff affects us in our life and, like... Dude, but there's a difference between spirits and, like, bad spirits. Like, that means you don't know what's gonna happen to you in that house like when you move in like it literally said dark entity that's why a part of me regrets coming here to film this video because i hope i didn't just invite a spirit into my new house before i moved in oh, I hope not. Not end the video but i want you guys to help i want everybody to just comment down below what you guys think do you think that this entity roman the, this dark Dude, entity don't keep saying the name Okay. Yeah, I would stop saying that. Okay. Do you guys think that this spirit has been in this house ever since the old homeowners lived here? Or do you think that this spirit is one that's just attached to me and it's going to follow me in every single house? Bro, bro it's, it's attached, attached to you in my life. And like, I want Brian. answers. And clearly, I'm not getting answers from doing these haunted videos. The ghost just ends up messing with me. You guys don't understand Roman or whatever the hell the ghost wants to call itself. That's the millionth different name that I, I've seen. Every time me or my brother make a ghost video, it has just random names. I feel like the ghost is just Charlie, messing with me. Noah, yeah, I feel like the ghost is just messing with me and it's just spitting out random names. And I just feel like I'm never gonna get answers if I keep on doing these haunted videos, me or my brother. So now I'm turning to you guys for answers. What do you guys think? Can you guys please help me out and comment down below just what you think about this whole situation? Look, it said up. And there's a plane. Or is it a UFO? Who knows? Wait, wait, wait. Oh my god, guys, the app said up and look up. There's a plane in the sky. Oh my goodness. Look guys, it said up and there's a plane. That's so creepy. Answer. No, delete that app, bro. No, bro, this is like, like not today. I'm done with this today, bro. We should call a priest, bro. We should do something. Either get a priest or try to, I don't know. I, don't know. I think we should definitely get the house blessed. That's for sure. Okay, guys, well, I'm done with today's video. I'm going to end it right here. And I just really, really hope I did not invite a bad spirit, negative spirit into my brand new home right before I moved in. Oh my god. Oh, oh my goodness. goodness. That... Ooh. All right, guys. I hope you guys did like today's video. video. If you guys, guys got goosebumps like I did. Uh, oh, oh my gosh. gosh. I want to blame you. But I hope you guys did like today's video. Make sure you guys hit the like button. Subscribe if you guys are new. Give me away at 200 subs. And I'll see you guys next time. Thank you.